From a distance, you almost can't tell the difference between the real bird and the balloon one. Terry Cook from Scotland makes balloon birds, but not just any old bird. Here he's making a wood nuthatch. Cook uses latex balloons in different sizes and colors. They've been his artistic medium for some time. I made one or two balloons for my niece's birthday party. And then after that, I thought, cool, it might be quite interesting to try and make something, uh, I don't know if more realistic is the right word, because they don't look realistic, but maybe closer to, to nature than the usual stuff that you see. Terry Cook has turned his attic into his studio. He lives in Aberdeen, teaches at a college there. He does balloon art in his free time. Cook doesn't need long for the balloon animals typical for children's birthdays. His bird creations, though, take several hours. Depending on which bird I pick, I'll, I'll look at a couple of images of it for all, on like Google or something like that, and so you can understand how the feathers look. You kind of pick out the balloons you want, and I just have a go from there, basically. Uh, there's no right or wrong way to do it. There's no, there's no rules for it, as long as you kind of, can kind of um, tie them into a shape that sort of vaguely resembles them, um, then you're on a winner. <laughs> Cook wants his balloon birds to look as real as possible, and that can be tricky. Finished. Now to the park, where he photographs the latex birds in the natural habitat of their real-life versions. They kind of, all in, under all the like little bits of bark and stuff, they stick their beak under and pick out little bugs and things like that. Um, but I just made it because it's a really cool looking little bright colored bird. Upside down on the tree, just like a wood nut hatch in real life. That's what Cook attempts to recreate. I've loved birds since I've been a kid. Um, like completely obsessed with birds. I love all animals, but specifically birds. Um, and I don't even know why. Native birds are his favorites. When the shoot's over, Cook takes his balloon animals home so as not to damage the environment. <laughs> 